hey everyone welcome back to another video and this time again last time as i showed you the multiplication trick with the five this time we're going to divide with the five uh not only five this time we have increased from five 25 and 125 this is going to be super easy so stick with the video and watch till the end and let's start this one let's suppose uh i'm going to divide this is the division okay divide by five okay we are talking about five numbers are five twenty five and one twenty five okay these are the number we're going to divide uh, some numbers in a very quick uh, way okay how to divide let's see this one for example let me divide uh, 70 uh, so let me write here 76 divided by 5 how easily we can do this one you see one thing is that okay this is written in your traditional way uh, let me show you uh, you can of course you can write this one in this form also same thing of course you are familiar with this one that we can write divide like this also in a fraction form so how easily we can do uh, you see the purpose of uh, doing it quickly is that you can calculate this one in your brain no need to write every time in copy of course uh, if you are um, dealing with some big number then you need to write on copy on your notebooks but mostly in uh, those simple mathematics we can mostly do in our brain so first of all we're going to make it 10 we'll try to make it 10 okay we'll we're going to make try to make in 10 100 and 1000 like this okay so to make 10 what you need to multiply here it's 2 isn't it and it will become 10 5 to the 10 so i'm going to multiply upside 2 see uh, okay first of all uh, before you think this is tough this is not tough if you practice you see once you have seen this one now you may think this is tough and for some you may think this is very easy and those who are thinking this is tough you just do one thing just practice this uh, way you going definitely you going to do it in a very faster way you see 17 2 ja is very easy we can just simply say 75 into 5 is uh, 150 and it's two times again so it will be 152 okay now this is multiplication of course if you don't know about this one you can multiply 6 to the 12 1 is 7 uh, 2 ja 2 7 the 14 plus 1 152 you see our answer is ready like you can just write 1.52 this is the, your division how we wrote how many zeros are there one so after one number i just put one point done this much only do you find difficulties in understanding this okay okay let me show you some number like uh, i'm giving some example over here let's suppose uh i'm trying to multi dividing with the five how much time will i take it it's very easy 3.6 you see because i have practiced up to some limit i have not practiced a lot but of course so, uh, i have practiced this one so for me you see it's taking only some second you, definitely this is not the fastest thing we can calculate but you can do more in a higher speed if you practice a lot okay so if you practice more than me of course you're going to do this one very easily so now how i got this one it's very easy you see i just try to make it 10 so i need to multiply with 2 it's a 10 and upside i multiply it's 36 so it will be how much one zero so 3.6 answer is done i hope you have understood this one let's see the another example uh, let's try with the some other number like uh, four not four sorry let's okay i'm trying i'm right writing this on four and let's divide the uh with the 25 okay so what answer will i get here how much time will it take it's very simple don't worry i'm just going to make it 100 so make it 100 i need to multiply by 4 25 4 sir. and upside win if we multiply downside then we're going to multiply downside you see that it makes sense because you see if i have uh, like for example 
1 or 2 is there. If I add uh, some number upside, then I have to add one more number this side. Because that will make the equality, means it will be same, okay. In maths, it's same. I'm talking about into, okay, not the things, that one. Why? You see, because suppose, for example, if I uh, multiply 2 upside and downside, it will be 2 to the 4. But you see, if we cancel downside, upside, it will be still same. Even if you cancel here, 2 1 the 2 and 2 to the, you see, 1 by 2 only, isn't it? It's same only, okay? That's why multiplication is same. We made 100 and 4 for the 16. You see, our answer is 0 0.16. You see, two zeros are there. So after two digit, you get point and then no number. So we put zero. So our answer is this one. Let me increase the number. You can say that this is very small. So I multiplied it quickly. Let me try this one. So how easily you can get this one? So I'm going to write 65, uh, four is your 240. So it will be 2.4. You see how easily we can get this one. So let's see this one. Um, because I need to make 100. So of course I'm going to multiply with four. Then only this will be 100. And then upside also four. So four five say is 20 and 424. So it's 260, isn't it? So now it's a four, five, four, six, four, uh, 24. Okay. Am I wrong here? Okay, you see four fives are 22 and six fours are 24. So it's three. Okay, I said maybe mistake. Sometime I also do some mistake. Two zero, so it will be 2.6. Isn't it cool? If you are finding this one difficult, then you can inform me. Of course, I will try to help you through uh, my another video. Means I will try to solve your queries regarding this topic. But I don't think this one need because um, it's too easy. Okay, you see, if you are if you want to know, then you can just multiply like this: sixty-five into four in quick way. Twenty to hand six four the six four the twenty-four plus two two sixty. You see two sixty only, isn't it? Okay, let's uh, give another example so that you can know it at least in some better way. Let's take some example, uh, some bigger number more than this. Okay, 91 and 25. You see, 91, 4, is 0, 9, 36, and 364. So 3.64, you see. It's quick, isn't it? Of course, it will take some time for you if you are not practicing a lot. But you see how I done this one. 91 by 25. Because I need to make it 100. So I multiply with 4, so upside is the 4, because you see 9, 4, 1, the 4, and 9, 4, 36. So 364. Two zeros, so after the 3.64, this is your answer. Isn't it cool? Okay, let's see one more, another example. This is time, this is with uh, 125. Okay. Okay, let's see that, another one. Let's suppose 8 by 125 and we'll try to make it uh, multiply to make it 100. 100 is not possible, sorry, this is 1000 because 100 is already, this is greater than 100. So next our number is 1000, okay. So we're going to do, you see this is also easy. Okay, let me try this one and this 8 is 64, so it will be 0. Uh, 0. 0.064. This is the answer. You see how easily we got. So this is so this is very easy. For example, you see as I said, we need to make it one thousand. So we'll be multiplying with the eight. So it will become one thousand, and we just multiply upside it. So it is the sixty-four. So number of zero is three. So I'm going to write six four. You see one two and one more zero and then point and zero. The, your answer is done. You can write some number by yourself, um, any number like 124 by 125, any, this example, you can try this one by yourself. You see, if you want to practice, you just write some number and then you write there, uh, and then you do it by yourself and then you can recheck in your calculator. It's very simple. Okay. Now I cannot give you each and every, uh, like, uh, questions over here, this one, that one, because you can write any number, just whatever comes in your mind, just downside should be 525 and 125 
and upside you can take any number okay okay till then this much only here and thank you so much for watching and if you like this one then please share with your friend so that at least you see now the nowadays mostly people they don't like studying and all this thing so they will study a lot if you share this one and they will see this trick this is amazing isn't it right so thank you so much for watching